Okay, more stats for geeks. Uh, we have our least squared regression line. Uh, y hat equals b naught plus b one x, where b one is this monster. That's the slope of our uh, our uh, um, regression line, and uh, b naught, of course, is uh, y bar minus b. I almost wrote m. B one times x bar. Okay meaning it goes to the point x bar, y bar. Okay, so now what I want to do is um, I'm just going to define r. I'm going to say I'm going to call r uh, this thing. The sum is, as uh, uh, i goes from 1 to n of xi minus, oh, come on, minus x bar times yi minus y bar over uh, n minus 1 times the absolute value of x times the absolute, I mean sorry, times the standard deviation of x times the standard deviation of y. Okay? You'll notice this looks a whole lot like b1 and it is a whole lot like b1. Okay? And you'll also notice that uh, if you just take this and uh, multiply it times sy over sx times sy over sx that what you get is the sy's cancel out and you get sx times sx and that's squared and now it's exactly the same thing. Okay? So what that tells us is b sub 1 equals r times the square root of y, I, I keep saying the square root, the standard deviation of y divided by the standard deviation of x. I'm sorry, I'm having a rough day. Okay. That's all fine and good, but let's get back to what r really is. Okay. Well, one way to look at R is to see that this thing is, uh, let's see, it's 1 over n minus 1 times the sum as i goes from 1 to n of xi minus, uh, minus x bar over standard deviation of x times yi minus y bar over the standard deviation of y. I'm getting all of my x's and y's accounted for there. Well, that's just 1 over n minus 1 times the sum of the product of the z-scores. Interesting. zx times zy. You'll sometimes see r defined that way as the product of the z-scores, the sum of the product of the z-scores times 1 over n minus 1. Or if your z-scores were used, uh, were calculated using sigma instead of s, it would be 1 over n. Uh, just one more way of, uh, of interpreting what r really is. But now what I want to do, now what I want to do is I want to look at uh, how r squared comes into play. Okay? So let's do that.